Well, another morning in Pelican Town. Day two, Ella. Day two. Oh, is that mail? I got mail. Hello there. Just got back from fishing trip. You should come down to the beach sometime. I've got something for you, Willie. Okay, I guess I'm going to stop by the beach first. Let me water my plants. Good morning, little plants. How are we? Oh, look at you guys have already started to grow. <gasps> okay. All right. Plants are growing. Excellent. Good job, Ella. Look at these guys. Oh, look at these ones are so tiny. I wonder what they're going to grow to be. Those were the, uh, I think the mystery seeds. All right. Oh, and then let me quickly fill up. Now, last night as I was falling asleep, I was thinking about what I used to be able to make slash what I learned now a wood storage chest that's what i desperately need it looks like i'll need about 50 pieces of wood and i currently have 21. hmm maybe i should quickly try to clear a few of these pieces up and then i'll also oh let me just do that and then pop that there and then i'll do this again okay a little bit clearer, but let me cut down at least one of these trees. And then I don't know how much of the farm I'd like to clear, to be honest. I wonder if I could make a tapper eventually so I could get some, um, like some syrups and stuff like that. Maybe some sap. Could use it to craft some other things, but also might fetch a good price. Hmm. Oh, you know what? I want to cut, I'll cut down this one too the seashells I picked up yesterday. I should probably put them in the bin and see if Mayor Lewis can sell them. I have a feeling I'll be able to pick up quite a few. It doesn't look like many people pick them up at the beach. And the nice thing would be to, um, you know, in case anybody makes jewelry or something like that, they could just use those with the seashells or, I mean, other decorative purposes, but it's there, so maybe he'll be able to fetch a good price for that. Now, I think it was aha perfect all right so now i can use this wood chest i'm gonna leave it probably oh where do i want to put it hmm there looks good and then i'm gonna store the plant material i got i'll store the extra seed the stone and the wood and also the daffodils hmm i wonder how long they'll preserve for i guess i'll find out excellent oh you know what just in case I pick up a lot of stuff while I'm in town today. Um, oh, I want to put the watering cannon. I don't need it right now, and I don't want to have to carry it if I don't need it. Oh, and then I forgot to pick up... What is on earth? Is that sap? Huh, I wonder what I, I, wonder what I could do with that. I don't want to sell it just in case, so I'll put that there. Hmm, you know, I know I need to go visit the gentleman that said he just came back from his fishing trip, but... I would very much like to see what is on the other side of the farm. I feel like I've only seen a portion of it, which is weird. Oh, is this another exit? Oh, so I guess I have three ways I can either get in or out of the farm, which is good to know. Hmm. I guess I'll just clear up a little bit of this. I wonder where this leads. This is a good source of stone, though. Maybe I'll be able to make some stone pathway soon. Oh, Oh, that'd be really pretty. Okay, so stone pathways are definitely a thing to consider soon. Looks like some of this is giving coal, which is very nice. All right, so what's down here? Hmm. This is, is this a, a farm of sorts? Or is this just forest? I wonder if I could cut trees here. I should check with Mayor Lewis. Maybe I could check in with him. And see if he has any objections to that. Wow, this looks, this is huge. I didn't realize there was so much land here. Wow, okay. It's kind of weird. There's not another farm here or anything like that. Interesting. Okay. And this river is huge. I wonder where it drops off to. Oh, what's that? Is that, I think that's a horseradish. Okay. I could easily make something delicious with that tonight. Oh, look at this little abandoned house. Oh, that's so sad. Oh, maybe somebody will move in eventually. All right, what is this? Oh, is this another little flower? 
I think that's a dandelion. Oh, that's precious. Okay. Yeah, two dandelion. Excellent. Can't I make a salad with dandelions too, I feel like? What is over here? Nothing interesting. I mean, it's all beautiful except what on earth? Oh, no. No. Mm-mm. That is a weird looking gate though. I wonder, oh, look at how pretty the butterflies are. A lot of trees, so I could definitely get a lot of resources from here. Is that a wild onion? I think so. Oh, good. Okay, that goes really nice with a lot of different dishes. Perfect. Oh, you know what I just realized? I never checked the, the weather for tomorrow or even <laughs> see what my fortune was. That's so weird. Oh. Another person I haven't said hi to you. Hello. Hi. Hello. It's nice to meet you. It's, it's nice to meet you too. I'm Ella. How are you? You picked a good time to move here. The spring is lovely. Yeah, it seems very nice. It's, it's nice to meet you. All right. People aren't quite as scary here as I was thinking they might be. So that's good. What is this? Oh, is this a farm supply store? I wonder. Um, I appear to have walked into an empty home. How awkward let me let me leave and uh maybe i'll see the owner at some point i don't know who it is <gasps> and look at the cows hello little cows hi oh aren't they cute you know i wouldn't mind getting a cow or two down the road i mean milk would be nice fresh milk every day and i could make cheese with that maybe i could also get some um some chickens and i could make well really anything with eggs Hello? Um... Ahoy there, miss! Hello, are you the gentleman who sent me the note? Heard there was a newcomer in town. Good to finally meet you. It's nice to meet you, too. I'm Ella. Ah, I'm still trying to unwind from a month out on the salty seas. A month? That is an awfully long time to be away from home. It was a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. Well, I hope you enjoyed it. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. Huh. Here, I want you to have my old fishing rod. Oh, that's awfully nice of you, Willie. Are you sure you don't want to keep it for sentimental value or anything? Or It's important to me that the art of fishing stays alive. And hey, maybe you'll buy something from the shop once in a while. I will definitely be into browse. Thank you very much for the present. I appreciate that. Thank you. You received a bamboo pole. There's good water here in the valley. All kinds of fish. Okay, I guess I need to start learning more about fish. Oh yeah, my shop's back open now, so come by if you need supplies. I will. Thank you. I'll also buy anything you catch. Oh, good to know. Um, Mayor Lewis said that there was a box by my house. Does that work too, or...? If it smells, it sells. <laughs> That's what I used, my old pappy used to say anyway. Okay. Um, uh, good to know. All right. I guess it's time to learn how to fish. Let me see. I think I don't have much room in my backpack. So you know what? I'm going to have a quick snack of the horseradish. It shouldn't be too, too bad. Nice and fresh. That was actually quite delicious. Okay, um, let me try fishing, I guess. Just cast like that and then wait, I guess. It's kind of peaceful if, I, uh, if I'm being honest. Just sitting here watching the water. That's not bad. It's a good way to spend a quiet afternoon. The ocean's kind of calm. It's really, oh, what is that? Is that a fish? <gasps> Oh, okay. Finally a fish. A f oh, 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 oh. No, 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 little guy. Don't go anywhere. Don't go anywhere. Okay. <gasps> I got my first fish. I don't know what kind of fish it is. I think it's an anchovy. Oh, okay. Nice. All right, Ella. You caught your first fish. Okay. Nice. Well. Oh, Elliot. Hi. A great idea can pass through your head while you least expect it. But if your mind is too busy, you might miss it. Huh. I never thought of it that way. 
Well, I really must get back to my work. Um, have a good day, Elliot. Thank you for chatting. Huh, I never thought of it that way. All right. Oh, hi. I don't think I've introduced myself to you yet, have I? Um, I'm Ella. Mayor wanted me to say hi to everybody. That's awkward, I know. I'm sorry. Hey, I'm Sam. Good to meet you. It's nice to meet you too, Sam. Is that... Okay. I think that that was it. Uh, Vincent, hi. And then... How are you? Mom won't let me have any more gummies today. Oh, I'm sorry, Vincent. That's no fun. Penny, what's up? I'm tutoring Vincent and Jazz today. They're a handful, but it's nice to make a difference in someone's life. I agree. I agree. It's awesome that you're teaching them. Uh, you must be Jazz then. Hi. Hi. Uh, hello. Okay. Oh, is this finally? This is open. Oh, I can pop in. What is it? What? Where am I? Is this the library? <gasps> we have a library in Pelican Town? Oh, well, that's delightful. Hello there. Welcome to the Stardew Valley Archeo Archaeological Office. Oh, so not the library. This is embarrassing, but the previous curator made off with the entire collection. We don't have any artifacts for display. Oh, that that's fine. I'm just new, so I'm trying to learn where everything is. I'm hoping to remedy that soon. Hey, if you find any artifacts or minerals out there, would you let me know? Absolutely. Absolutely, I can. I hope you have a nice day. Hmm. Oh, how awful, though, that the previous curator made off with everything. Why would somebody do that? What's in here? It's locked. Open nine. Okay, nine to four for... This almost looks like a smithy. Hmm. I wonder who runs that. All right, so down here. I don't think I went down here yesterday. Oh, is that a... I'm just going to pass. I still have nightmares about Joja, so... Um, I'm just going to keep going. Hmm. Oh, what's this? Is this a store? Hi! Hi, um, I'm Ella. It's Miss Ella, the new farmer. I'm Pierre, owner of the local general store. Oh, it's nice to meet you, Pierre. If you're looking for seeds, my shop is the place to go. I also buy produce for a good price. Oh, okay, excellent. Um, is this, can I just browse and then pick what I need kind of thing? Hmm. It's tending the shop. Okay, so Pierre is not tending the shop right now. I see. I'm sorry. Um, is this, can I go back and introduce myself? I don't think I said hi to everybody. Is that, is that Robin? Hey, Robin. I, we meet every week to encourage each other to stay healthy. Oh, that's fun. That's such a nice thing that you guys do together. I don't think we've met. Hi, I'm Ella. It's nice to meet you. I'm going to sleep well tonight. Uh, yes, it's very nice to meet you. I don't think we've been introduced. I'm going to go. Caroline, Jody. it's nice to see you both. Um, I don't want to intrude. That would be rude. Um, I just, just, hi, um, I'm Ella. I don't. Is it okay if I come in and say hi? No, I don't think so. Okay, that's fine. I'll um, I'll see you later. Pierre, it was nice meeting you. Hmm, what is this? Oh, I guess we have a town calendar. Is this, is this for birthdays? Oh, how nice. And it looks like there are festivals. There's an egg festival and a flower dance. Interesting, there are a lot of birthdays in the spring. Okay, gonna have to start remembering all that. Looking for bream, cash payment on delivery. I don't know what a bream is. I might not be the best person to take that job. I should um leave that for somebody who actually knows what a bream is. All right. What's up here? Oh, right. I remember I was here yesterday. I wonder if the, um, is this where Robin is? Oh, hi. Um, hi, I'm Ella. Greetings, I'm Demetrius, a local scientist and father. Thanks for introducing yourself. Anytime, Demetrius. Thank you for saying hi. I'm studying the local plants and animals from my home laboratory. Have you met my daughter, Maru? She's interested to meet you. I did, I did. She's really nice. Thank you. Uh, have a good day. Is it Sebastian? Hi, Sebastian. I was thinking people are like stone skipping over the water. Okay. Eventually, we're going to sink. Not everybody. That's, um... It's kind of sad to think about it that way, if I'm being honest. I wouldn't say everybody is going to sink. I mean, some people, of course, but 
Not everybody. Um, hmm. There's nobody here again. Do you think I could go in? Hello? Hi, I just... Hello? Anybody home? Hi, I just wanted to introduce myself. I, I hope this isn't as awkward as it feels, because it... Oh boy, does it feel awkward. A stranger, hello? Hi, it's nice to meet you. Don't mind me, I just live out here alone. N no problem, I... I too live out on my own alone, so I understand. It's nice to meet you. Have a good day. Let me know if you need anything. I have a farm full of like food and stuff like that. If you end up needing anything, just, just stop on by and say hi. Hmm. I wonder if I can give people gifts. Hmm. They'll have to start looking into Oh, I forgot to ask Mayor Lewis if I could um um Cut up down those trees in the forest by the f animal supply store, was it? I'll have to do that tomorrow. I should really start a to-do list. Actually, I do have a to-do list currently. I've, uh, I planted the parsnips. Apparently, I think I'm mi missing some people. Mayor Lewis had given me a rough sketch of everybody. Let me see. I've met most people in town. Who, am I missing? I'm missing just a few people. Okay. Hmm. Hopefully I'll get to see them tomorrow. You know, I should also see about getting some kind of silo up. Because I have a feeling mixed in with these gorgeous flowers is um some food that I could use. Oh, oh no, I don't have enough room. Uh, some food that I could use in case I get future barn animals or maybe even just use for other things. But I should definitely look into that i'm gonna leave the the fishing pole there and then the coal i don't need there we go excellent okay just to make some room just want to clear like the twigs and stuff like that just give us a little bit more room still want to see about getting a dog eventually oh is this this looks like a rundown greenhouse you know i'm really glad grandpa's farm is Kind of out in the mountainy area. It's just a little foresty, a little mountainy. It's just kind of tucked away. Glad it's just not a farm. It has some character to it, which is really nice. I was worried this would just be like a great big plot of land and I wouldn't know what to do with it. I mean, in fairness, I don't know what to do with this now, but this is better than what it could be, I'd imagine. Also, should see about making some torches to, uh, leave around the farm so I could easily see and make my way around as I'm doing things, especially if we have to, or if I have to keep clearing. I imagine this stuff grows back, as plants are known to do, which is good. But, you know, I'm gonna have to do some clearing, especially as the seasons change. I imagine the clearing itself changes. I could, hmm... Maybe in the morning, I'll, um, I'll plant the extra here. Let me see if I do that. So that's a spot. This, 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 this. If I do, yeah, I don't want to connect them. I'd like some space, like eventually so I could put pathways. I don't know if this will be the final planting zone, though. I haven't decided on that. So I'll do that, and then that. How many? I have four. I should be able to quickly get that there. And then let me just grab my water and can. Oh, and then I have two more too. You know what? I'm going to put those in there. The anchovy should last, I imagine. I mean, it seems a little weird, but... um, I mean, try it and see what happens kind of thing, right? Right. That's fine, Ella. It makes sense. Put a fish in a storage chest. I mean, this is Pelican Town and Stardew Valley, and you never know what's going to happen here. All right. Good. Okay, I feel like I was able to be productive. It is starting to get late, though. Clay. Oh, clay is going to be very useful down the road. Okay. So, I feel confident enough in everything that I've done to, uh, to go to bed, which will be good. Get a good night's sleep. Oh, maybe quickly. Oh, you know what? I'll just check the TV in the morning. Time for some sleep. Oh, it's raining out this morning. Well, I guess I don't have to, uh, 
water my plants. I'll, uh, I'll tuck, tuck the watering can away. That's a good thing. Okay. Oh, I got more mail. Okay. And it looks like I also made some money from the, uh, the seashells, which is really good to know for the future. Advertisement. I keep finding cool stuff, but my backpack is full. Does this sound like you? Well, Pierre's got you covered. Stop by Pierre's General Store today and check out our affordable size 24 backpack. See you soon. Um, oh, wasn't Pierre the, the gentleman I came across? Um... Oh, yesterday was it in the general store? Okay, well that's good to know. Oh no, I didn't check. You know what? Quickly, Ella. Let's see what, aha, the weather report. Welcome, your number one source for what? Yes, yes. It's going to be clear and sunny all day. So tomorrow it'll be nice out, that's good to know. And what does the fortune teller say? The only show where the voice of the spirits is channeled directly to you. That's still weird. Spirits are in good humor today. I think you'll have a little extra luck. Oh, I wonder if I should try my hand at fishing then. I'm very unlucky when it comes to fishing. So you know what? Maybe I'll just sneak that. And maybe I'll do a little bit of fishing today. It's a very good idea. Oh, but you know what? Hmm. Before I go fishing, I would love to see if I think Robin said her store was up this way. And I believe, didn't I meet... Demetrius Robin's husband, I want to say. I think so. If I know, if I'm, if I'm getting everybody right, um, I think Robin said this is her store. I wonder how much a silo would cost so I could clear up some of those plants. As much as I just don't want to. It's 9 a.m. Oh, I'm awfully early. Oh, I hope I didn't wake anybody. Hmm. Let me go. Maybe I can do some fishing up here. I don't think anybody would mind. I'll just fish for a few minutes, and then when it gets to be a little bit closer to nine, I'll hop back over and see. Is that something? <gasps> fish already! It's so early in the day. Okay, this little guy is cooperating. Excellent! What did I get? He's a big fish! I think he's a bass. Okay. That is an awfully large fish. I'm surprised I got it out of the water. All right. It is kind of peaceful in the rain, though, fishing. Kind of like this. Hmm. I could definitely get used to this. Life in general. Farming. Fishing. So far, the people haven't been too, too mean, which is good. Or, I mean, nobody's really been mean now that I think about it. I'm just so shy about it. Like, I shouldn't be. You should just... Ella, you should just go say hi. That's really not a big deal. Ugh. Oh, this fish is giving me... Quite a bit of trouble, huh? What did I get? I don't know what kind of fish that is. I think it's a bullhead, though. I've really got to do some more I'm reading on the different types of fish that are around in uh, in Pelican Town. Just a lot of... I'm surprised by how many different kinds of fish there are. I mean, in general, but especially around here. What is this? Another. Okay. Maybe this one won't be quite as difficult to catch. Okay. Yes. And a chub. Okay. He looks interesting. I'm going to go. Okay. That was quite enough fishing for right now. I definitely want to go to the ocean though. Maybe do a little bit of fishing. But first, let me check in with Robin. Hi, Robin. How are you? I think I need to come around here to say hi properly. The rain doesn't stop me from getting the job done. I bet it doesn't. Now, I just want to know, uh, just for farm buildings... Hmm, a chicken... Okay, so I can have you make me a chicken coop. Okay, how is it? Uh, a barn? A well? I seem to be fine on the well front. I think that, um... I have the two pawns, so I don't need one, but... Oh, it's so pretty. Maybe eventually I'll get one for... Hmm, hmm, I wonder where I could put one on the farm. I might get one eventually, just because it's so pretty. The silo, yes! Okay, so it's a hundred gold, which I have... A hundred stone. I don't have that. Five copper bar. Huh. And ten clay. I wonder where I could get the copper bars from. Maybe the smithy sells them. I could check. Or maybe there's a way to harvest my own. A mill allows you to create flour. Okay. Oh, very nice. Well, eventually, I mean, that's all. This is a long way away, but 
a shed. Fill it with whatever you like. Oh, okay, good. I'm probably going to need one of those eventually because I did read uh, in, in that class I took about different ways to preserve food. And I'd like to get some preserve jars going eventually as well as some uh, kegs so I can make, you know, fresh juice and stuff like that. Maybe even some spirits, some fresh wine. Maybe it's something Gus might be interested in. I'll have to talk to him about that. But very much going to need one of these down the road. A fish. Oh, a specialty pond. Raise fish and harvest their produce. Oh, how delightful. Okay, so I'm definitely going to need one of these. Maybe two, depending on what I want to do in the end. I wonder if I could get some, um, some like fish, make caviar or something like that. Oh, that would be delightful. A little cabin if we have anybody that needs it okay good to know and then a sta oh a stable a horse included oh oh that is something i okay yes i'm very very much interested in that i need ten thousand gold so it's something i'm gonna have to save up for a hundred hardwood and five iron bar huh all right and then a slime hutch. What is, on earth raised 20 slime? What are slimes? I haven't come across those before. And I already have a shipping bin, but thank you. And we're back to the cube. Okay, thank you, Robin, for that. I appreciate it. Is it Dim Demetrius, how are you? We're insulated from the rest of the world here in Stardew Valley. Maybe that's a good thing. Maybe it is. I would agree. Oh, okay. I guess that's all you had to say. All right. Um, what did I want to do? I know that there was something. Hmm. Seems like it's so quiet when it's raining. Nobody else is really around, but I mean, it is a Wednesday. Hmm. I wonder what kind of seeds Pierre sells. I should quickly go check. I assume he's open. Oh, I wanted to go see the smithy. That's right. And see if he had any uh, copper bars closed on Wednesdays. Oh, okay. Well, that's good to know. I guess I'm not going to go see Pierre. Is this... Was Granny's house. I wonder. I should check in and say hi. Oh, I don't think we've met. Hello. Hey, you're the new girl, huh? I think we're going to get along great. I'm Alex. I'm Ella. It's nice to meet you. I'll see you around. Yes, you will. Granny, hi. When I woke up, I heard dripping from somewhere. I think the roof might be leaking. Oh no. Should I send somebody over to look at that? Is there? Could Mayor Lewis help? Is there a carpenter? Oh, Robin. Of course. Silly Ella. Uh, do you want me to send Robin over? Or... In the old days, George would have scampered right up to fix it. Oh, I'm sorry. Do you want me to send Robin, though? I could stop by on my way home. Are you George? I don't think we even introduced George. Hi, I'm Ella. It's irritating to have to meet all these new people, huh? <laughs> I wouldn't say that it's irritating. It's a little intimidating, though. Name's George, by the way. Now buzz off. It's nice to meet you. Okay, that was... That was an experience. All right, well, I think I finally met Granny's husband, which is good to know. Um, And then I think finally I can see who the smithy is. Oh, Clint, wasn't it? Hello, how are you? Um, I would just like to know. Okay, so you sell copper ore. But you don't sell any kind of pre-made bars. Okay, so I guess I'm going to have to just see about finding my own ore. By the way, I just want to say hello. What do you... I just want to say hi. I'm sorry. I will uh, catch you later or a different day, I guess. Uh, have a nice day. Well, that was awkward again. Oh, Penny. Oh, no. You seem to be stuck in the rain. Is everything Okay. You're going to go inside. You just wanted a quiet moment. I understand. I'll, I'll leave you to it. I hope you have a good quiet moment. All right. I kind of want to go see what the fishing is like by the ocean right now. If, supposedly, the fortune teller is right, which, I mean, maybe. Supposedly, I have good luck today. Or at least slightly better than average luck. They didn't really say if I have good luck or slightly better than average luck so there's that hmm okay let's go fishing nice and relaxing all right so i think this will be my last fish of the night i've had a good haul so far today 
Looks like I got a lot. I think it's sardines and I don't know what the other fish is. And then I got some fish I hadn't seen before. A flounder. Huh. I wonder if I could put those in the bin for Mayor Lewis to uh, to sell to, to Gus for me or whoever else might need them. Hmm. Or maybe Willie would buy them from him. And then the, another sardine. Okay. Good. Well, that looks like a nice healthy haul. And I've run out of space in my backpack. I'm definitely going to need to look into that uh, backpack upgrade eventually. But starting to get late. I wonder if there's anybody at the saloon I could just quickly nip on by and say hello. Just just in case anybody's in there. Um. Oh, there's quite a few people in here. Hi. I need a little warmy up to be ready for another cold night on the ocean. I understand, Willie. It is awfully cold out there today. Um, is it Harvey? Hi, Ella. Uh, read anything interesting in the library lately? I haven't. Do you have any good book recommendations? Or... Well, um, I'll see you around then. Y you... Absolutely. Uh, it was nice seeing you. Is it... Jody? Or... Leah, I'm sorry. I get I get everybody's names mixed up. Maybe I should cook something new and exciting today. Something spicy. Oh, spicy might be nice in this weather. It's so cold out. Is it Pam? Uh, you're too young to be moping around in a... I'm not moping around, but thank you for being concerned. Um, I'm literally just stopping by to say hi to everybody. Uh, how you doing, Gus? Can I get you anything? I'm good, actually, though. I did want to, um, to chat with you about... Possible. I'm gonna give uh, Mayor Lewis some fish to sell. So if you need any fresh fish for the for the food you sell, let me know. I've heard rumors of a rare, powerful magic rings forged long ago by forgotten civilizations. I'm not sure if it's true or just fairy tale. I love fairy tales, though, Emily. <gasps> oh, what if that is true? Oh, I'd love to find one. I wonder where I could. Um, I feel like I should. Oh, I don't think we've met. Oh, that's right. I heard someone new is moving into the... Yes, hi. I'm I'm Ella. It's nice to meet you. It's kind of a shame, really. I always enjoyed exploring those overgrown fields by myself. Well, I still have <laughs> plenty of overgrown fields. Feel free to stop by and still explore if you'd like. All right, I'm going to try this. Hmm, this weather makes me thirsty. Uh, well, there's plenty of water. I'm sure they have tea, too, uh, at the bar if uh, to warm you up it's very cold out oh isn't that sebastian there hi if you're lucky you might see a frog in this weather i've never seen a frog in this weather but thank you um i'll consider myself lucky if i find one then clint is it didn't i i already said hi yeah i, I don't want to disturb mm -mm. i think i made him uncomfortable trying to say hi earlier doesn't mean i can't try a little harder to be friends i mean Mayor Lewis is right, though. I should get to know everybody and try to be friends. I mean, maybe Clint just has a different set of things that he either wants to talk about or makes him happy or anything like that. Oh, oh, no, I can't grab these. I don't have. Oh, you know what? I have just enough time. Let me pop those in the bin and then every like in the storage and then the selling. And then I'm going to go quickly over and snag those because those are so pretty. The daffodils might make us uh, some very nice presents. Now, I already have an anchovy, so I'm, I'm going to save the flounder. I want to save oh, only one herring. I just want to save one of everything to be safe. I'll save a sardine uh, and then the other the other fish, just in case anybody needs one. And then I just want to be able to afford all the everything that I'm going to need. Especially the horse was very expensive, but that's going to be very worth it. A, it'll be nice just to have some companionship, and B, I definitely do need to uh, get places probably a little bit faster than what I'm doing on my own. And that daffodil, I wonder if anybody likes those as presents. Oh, oh no, oh, whoops, accidentally used my fishing rod there. That's embarrassing. Good thing uh, nobody was watching. All right, starting to get late, but I still have a little bit of energy left. Maybe... Hmm, maybe I could clear out another tree to be safe. You know, the only thing is, it's awfully dangerous. Like, I'm going to trip over one of these trees or something like that if I can't see where I'm going later at night. So, you know, it'd probably be good to, to pick some of these up just in case. Anything over here? And then, I wonder where I'd put the silo. 
you know, I bet it would look nice. I have this whole empty area over here. I could easily pop it somewhere like here. That's probably not a bad idea. And then, hmm, I could also leave one kind of tucked away back here maybe, but then I'd lose access to the behind the house. Hmm. I could also clear out this area. Oh no, but there's some kind of, what is that I wonder? Huh. I see these floating around. So maybe I don't want to put a silo there. I could put one here. Hmm. I could even put one up and back behind the, um, the broken greenhouse. Huh. Little things to keep in mind. Oh, look at this. I wonder if I could get this tree stump up tonight. I don't think my axe is strong enough. I wonder if Clint could handle that for me. I bet he could. I bet he could. Hmm. I'll have to talk to him about that. I'm starting to get awfully tired. All right, you know what? Bella, let's... Time to get some sleep. Let me put that away and I'll put that there and then I'm gonna put the fishing rod away and then let me grab the watering can for the morning just just to make things a little bit easier on myself all right so good day I think it's time to get some sleep and uh see what tomorrow brings <laughs>